Alright guys, alright guys, so uh, this is just some quick news that I wanted to get out of the way for Bleach because uh, we just recently had the K-Lab Game, Game Station live stream like a couple of hours ago and already took some snapshots, put them on the Discord server, so I'm gonna go ahead and pretty much show off what they're gonna bring to us for this week and next week. So yeah, tom uh, not uh, not tomorrow, but the day after tomorrow, we are getting a new 3% gacha with Kaname, Mashiro, and Ryuken. So, yeah, if you guys need any of these units, then go for it. Kaname is a guild quest beast. Mashiro is basically a watered-down uh, manga Bankaichigo. So, if you kind of already had him, you don't need Mashiro, but Mashiro is still a damn good uh, strong attack recharge link to use for Ichigo, or even as a playable character. To be honest, I use her, and she's actually quite fun. And then we have Ryuken, who is um, the 20 DR link for Retsu, so, yeah. I am certainly not going to summon on this band, because I have almost all three of them, except Kaname. I would summon for him, but come on, man, why these fillers? I don't need another Ryukan. I already have enough of them, like four of them. And I don't need another, another Mashiro either. So yeah, that's it. And then we have a Mind Attribute Summon Banner on the 11th of September. Oh my god, 9-11. Are you serious? I swear to god, they want to do everything after 9-11. I don't fucking know why. But anyways, we have Shinji, Momo, and Tag Team Shuhei. All three of these characters are good. I already have Tag Team Shuhei, but I don't have Shinji or Momo, so I am thinking about dropping a couple of orbs because I do want to pull either Shinji or Momo. I wanted Shinji for so goddamn long, and I still don't have him. And Momo, I want her just because she's a damn good healer and pretty much the best around car so Sorry, Ken fans, but Momo's just way better. Banken just doesn't have a have a sprinter, which is bad. And then we get a we're getting a brand new sub story starting tomorrow. And uh, this is uh, I'm swear to God, out of all the sub stories, they had to pick an event that over. But anyways, this is just a um, sub story between uh, the the flashbacks of Yoruichi and Soifon. And of course, there th this uh, sub story, of course, like all the other sub stories, will be available at all times, so you can play whenever the fuck you want. And then, oh, yes, thank you, thank you. Senkai Mon Quests are coming back this Monday. Well, not this Monday because it's my best. <laughs> Next Monday on the 10th of September. So yeah, finally. We're, be sure to go ahead and do that because you can get so many orbs off of this and enough to buy either a new Eisen or a six star ticket. Either way, the Senkai Mon Quests are good shits. And then we have a new lottery event coming up on the same day as Senkai Mon Quests, and of course we're getting a new 4-star Rengiku. So, yeah, this is actually good. Good way to farm up some orbs. I'm, I, love, I love how Caleb likes to give away things. And this is what we get from the uh, new lottery event. We're getting 4-5 um, to five star tickets and Brave Soul tickets from the lottery rewards. And of course, we're gonna get the Brave Souls tickets from the the small points event thing. Well, not the points event that happened just now, but, I mean, this coming one. So, yeah. And then, um, oddly enough, we are not getting any boss rush. This is what we're getting. Basically, we're getting the Lost Asian Soul Reaper Army Awakened quests. Which means that if you do um, all, all five attributes three times, you get to unlock aw the Awakened quests. Which is basically Nightmare Mode, and you can basically farm up uh, four to five star accessory tickets and whatnot. So, yeah, I'm kind of surprised because normally we don't get this uh, kind of thing until the after the mid-month, after the month month gacha. So, yeah, I'm kind of surprised. No bus rush. And then, of course, we are getting extreme co-op again. So, this will be good for me since I'm in fourth seat and I'll be going back up in third seat to uh, go ahead and grind some editing brushes. So, if you guys are in fourth seat... Good luck to all of you that are trying to stay in the promotion zone, so that way, yeah, 
we need to farm these editing brushes because they're not easy to come by and they are very useful for re-rolling 5 star accessories and getting 30% SP, 30% attack on whatever whatever things you need. I for sure need a 30% SP on a Mind and Raku for Tsukishima and I hope I, I get that. And what, okay this completely caught me off guard because at the same time we're getting extre extreme co-op we are also getting Enriched Droplet Zone again. And when did we have Enriched Droplet Zone again? We had it like like two weeks ago. Actually no, it was last week. So to get it this early means that this is pretty much a big improvement because it just means that Extreme Co-op can coincide with either Inheritance Zone or Droplet Zone. Thus giving us way more ways to, you know, farm things. But I, I sure do hope that it's the droplet zone that come back, that comes back way more often than uh, inheritance zone because let's be real here droplet zone now that we can use uh, ticket multis on raids and droplet trials this has kind of become a really useless thing unless you you run out of tickets trying to level up some characters or gathering um, droplets this is more like a secondary thing you should do but either way, I'm not touching into the droplet so no thank you. I'm gonna go ahead and, and do extreme co-op. So yeah, um, that is all I needed to talk about. This is just the information of upcoming events that we're getting. So um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. And I'm sorry if I haven't been uploading much, but very soon I will have a beginner's guide up for my channel. Just that I kind of need to get to work on my thumbnails because I have no idea what to show off to make uh, the video attracting for viewers to watch so <laughs> I kinda have no idea I'm gonna have to think about that but of course I did already um, record some characters versus inheritance zones that I still need to edit so um, yeah just that I've been kinda busy so yeah uh, thank you guys for watching and um, I'll see you guys next time peace out